All right, welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen, to <laughs> another beautiful, magnificent, expeditious, expeditious, expeditious. <laughs> well, welcome to another beautiful episode of Music is Critical TV. It's episode 34. 34. 30 motherfucking four. And y'all see, we got some new microphones and shit, shit in the uh, building. You know what I'm saying? Some new equipment. New equipment. New equipment. I know we were sounding like we was in a uh, parking lot of Lakewood Mall. <laughs> <laughs> Sound a little crazy, but now I know you can hear. I know, I know that was a good one. That was a good one. I know. But to start off, let me just let me just go on an introduction. You know, it's your boy. It's the one, not the motherfucking two. You know, the Don Dada. Hey, with Mexicans eating enchiladas. Hey, <laughs> we eating enchiladas too. It's your boy Breezy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what up? What up? It's your boy Dejan Michaels. We in the building. You know, nice, beautiful episode thirty four. Let's get it. And it's your boy Edison. All right, y'all, y'all know how. <laughs> do the peace time. So y'all know how I like to do every episode. How are you guys doing? Well, let me let me go from my left to my right. Dede, how are you doing? I'm doing do that, excellent, man. I'm awesome. feeling I'm feeling great. You're a little too happy. Man. I'm feeling happy. Yeah, are you you feel me? I'm feeling mm-hmm. alive. I'm feeling full of life and energy. I'm ready to do this. What you, you been doing this week? I've been just chilling. Chilling? Yeah, I'm chilling. Okay, okay. I'm on a little cleanse right now, so I just been are chilling. You on a cleanse? Yeah. Why? What just, you doing? Just a little cleanse. Cleanse on what? Cocaine? No. Uh, okay. I'm just checking. I'm just checking. Alcohol. No alcohol, alcohol cleanse. Yeah. 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 Niggas been going hard. Ah, going gotta, hard. Sometimes it. you got to do that, though. Sometimes you got to cleanse your body, get your mind right. If his mind was a song, it'll be walking for like a heart in the paint. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. We're going we to we not that hard this week. What's well, easy. What up? How was your weekend? Not how was your weekend. How was your week? <laughs> My week was great. What did you do? Just chilled, work, okay. you know. They some chilling motherfuckers for when I see look these Instagram stories. I don't have nothing on my Instagram. Doing anything, but <laughs> anything but chilling. Anything but chilling. Past week we've been well, chilling. Oh me? I'm glad you guys asked. Yeah, how you doing? How you I'm doing? doing pretty good, you know? I ran uh, back and forth to Guitar Center to get a couple things for okay. a, a lot of times. I thought you was about to say literally ran, but I got <laughs> it's like I did. When you <laughs> drive in the car for a certain amount of time, it's like you're running. <laughs> hey man, that drive was. It wasn't that long, but it felt like it took hours. It felt like it took hours for sure. You guys drove all the way to Orange County, didn't you? No, no, no. He wasn't a part of that mission. <laughs> we just drove I like. A, I was on that mission. Why'd Stay. you have to go to uh, Orange County? Long story. I'm not even. Gonna, huh. it's not even worth. Nobody cares. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, let's just get straight into motherfucking topics. The double XL freshman freshman class <laughs> is out. 2021 freshman class. We got 42 Doug, Flo Millie. Moray, that's my boy, I fucks with him. Pooh Shiesty, uh, Lakia, Koi, Laray, Tushy. Excuse me. <laughs> First of all, it's Toozy. Toozy. It's Toozy, not Toozy. I'm reading it right now, it's all bad. You thinking, Toozy. You think a nigga about to name himself Tushy <laughs> <laughs> and make it in the rap game? <laughs> Hey. <laughs> this nigga said Tushy. <laughs> what type of nigga? <laughs> if his name was hey. Tushy, I know what he was doing to get that position. Hey. <laughs> no disrespect, but I guess. Tuzi. Uh, Tuzi, Blast, DDG, wow. Ruby Rose, and Ian Dior. Quick, your favorite off the top. Blast. Your favorite off the top, Edison. I didn't really listen to it. Your favorite off the top. <laughs> Blast. You see how they all what about answers? yours? Who's yours? Blast. Oh, you already damn, know. Well, West Coast. West Coast. Hey, Blast. Blast your is shit. A, um, Blast and um, Moray, but I haven't heard too much from Moray to even make that decision. Moray? So I'm gonna just go with Blast. Moray is hard. I fuck yeah, with Moray. is hard. He Mo- from uh, the North- same place as uh, J. Cole. J. Cole. North from yeah. South Carolina. Don't remember. Carolina. Just say that. Carolina's finest. Carolina's finest. You know what I'm saying? So everything. Compared to. So Blast, your favorite. Who's your least favorite? My least you favorite. Be critical about uh, this. Honestly, I can't even really say because I haven't listened to all of their music. So I can't even be Who biased like that to say is my least favorite. Your least favorite. Bro, if I had a least favorite, I would tell you, okay. but I don't. Okay. Um, I can tell you we're, my you know second. We're not, not going to go with least favorite. I don't want anyone to do negatives on this shit. Yeah, they we're going to do positive. They, they, they all, all doing their shit. They did, something, they did something to get on this cover. Who's your? Whatever. Edison, that, something yeah. For the people be. you do know, who is your favorite personality on here? Personality? Yeah. Personality. Who's your favorite personality? I'm going to say mine first, Coyle Ray. Yeah, off top. Yeah, she got some swag on her. Okay, who's your first? Yeah, you score the rate too? Yeah. I mean, um, I like DDG. DDG? DDG? Okay. okay. Wasn't he a YouTuber? YouTuber, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, DDG was a YouTuber and decided to uh, delete all his YouTube videos and um, take it serious rapping. That's right. You doing your so, shit, my guy. Do your thing. Okay, let's get on to the real, real shit. <laughs> the the motherfucking the freestyles. freestyles. <laughs> what do you think? Edison, let's go to a, uh, we ain't going to ask an artist. We're yeah, ask, yeah. Let's ask Edison now. 
normal listener. I'm not gonna say. Um, can you? Oh, sorry. I wasn't impressed. Oh, you wasn't impressed? No. Nobody impressive. No. No. Okay. Okay. A lot of people weren't impressed. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of people weren't impressed. I went online. Everybody was talking about Coyle Ray and her yeah. freestyle. Um, I think artists need to uh, put more stock into their 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 lyrics. Yeah, instead of how they look. Yeah, because everybody was fresh to death. Everybody had the Dior hat. Yeah, everybody, everybody was fresh as fuck. With the blinged out yeah. chain, the VVS Bust downs. Yeah, all they, this everybody, and that. everybody. Everybody was pretty uh good. Fly. Everybody was pretty good, but them them raps, they wasn't selling for me either. Yeah, it, it seemed like everybody just wrote their shit like 10 minutes before they started shooting it. Yeah, no, they wrote it when it was there. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like 10 yeah, minutes while they about to shoot, like while they were oh, setting man. up the cameras and shit, like, oh shit, let me get some. <laughs> we really got a rap. <laughs> this was like, uh, really fucking, got a rap. We like, really got a rap right there. Huh? Let me write some shit real quick because yeah. I didn't know we was really rapping on the cypher. Yeah, the cypher was very underwhelming. I actually think Double XL should make more of a point to find rappers that are, when they get into the cypher, they're going to really rap. Really rap, yeah. You feel on me? Top. Double yeah. XL is like a. Uh, a staple of hip hop, yeah, quote unquote. You know, like so. I didn't really like the beat either. The beat I selection. Didn't like the beat. The producer wasn't the uh, the beat maker in the background. The little white boy with the <laughs> hair. He wasn't. He wasn't doing enough for me. He wasn't, wasn't, wasn't doing it for me. <laughs> he wasn't doing it for me. So. Right. And this is like this is just on some critical awareness shit from us. Like you feel me? Y'all may have a different opinion, but, but this our platform. They, they listen to so us. This they is how we feel. This is how I'm feeling about this shit. I feel like if you come into a double XL freshman freestyle, you better come with it. Especially when you think about the people who really came before. I mean, last year, was, I mean, they did their little shit, but I'm thinking about you already know my top double XL freestyle was with Kendrick. Oh yeah, that, his class, bro, that, that whole that's, class that's, that's was like, just gas. Like talking like when Jesus was here. Like, that's what I'm saying. It's like, like it's, oh it's, shit, like that's when motherfuckers was really it, rapping and it, really getting off. Like if you come into a double XL freestyle, it's like okay, I gotta be I gotta seen. Come with it I gotta come with it. The person yeah, next I'm to a, me gonna come right. with it. Right. I remember exactly. everybody says he didn't freestyle. Like he wrote that. Right. I mean, well, now everybody's writing their shit. Everybody nobody's writing. going up there and spitting off top of the dome. Yeah. People just don't trust themselves like that. But if a rapper does, nigga, he's the best. That's Jay Z. A freestyle ain't really a freestyle now. It's not a freestyle, freestyle. just a written that you memorize. But now I just think they call it a freestyle due to like just the setting when they group of people together yeah. or you know, yeah. they go to the radio. It's not no a verse they're using, so it's like a, a freestyle. No top. They were fresh though. They were. They were. Oh, they were. Everybody is fresh, fresh. The whole world is fresh. They should. But hey, you know what I think they fresh. should do? They should do like a. You know, they got the freshman class. They should do like an upperclassman freestyle so uh, upper class them niggas make too much money they are not doing that on double no more not for free not for, not they don't even they have to be like the upper classmen that's well who would you say is upper, upper classmen just somebody who got their name out there but could really spit put like a name you to feel it. me it's hard to put a name to it because so like the one at least the past year or something or yeah two, like i say i've been doing some shit past couple years but really not on on like that but really some spitters Oh, I don't know okay, yeah, like, like Tierra Wack. Like, yeah, I was about to say, like, Tierra yeah. Wack. Like, put her on some, like, upper yeah. class and type so shit. That need, let her gas. should like, get the opportunity right. to do it. Yeah, I, exactly. I agree with that. I agree with that. That'd be dope. Yeah. Um, I don't know what their goal is right now. I think it's whoever rides nuts to beg it the best. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'm thinking that's, that's the subject. <laughs> pretty much. Of who gets on. Because Whoever's the most popular on uh, Instagram and whoever got the most drama. Come mm-hmm. on. Let's go. I mm-hmm. guess that was the choice for, for quarantine, right? Yeah, hey, I don't know what the fuck they they doing to choose who are they choosing um do but, a motherfucking better job but uh yeah. i have i can't i can't say it to i don't know every rapper on here you guys, i don't either that's why i say honestly I can't. you guys did a good great job with blast i fuck with blast he's probably blast and Murray is Murray. one of my favorites on some music type shit yeah yeah that's on the list and i like coyle ray music too I, i'm coyle a fan ray, of her I shit her, her shit's dope i love her vocal i tone. like her her whole yeah, little, I like her personality uh, personality her music most of the songs i heard from her is dope Keep doing your shit. Fuck all the hate. People out here hating and shit, but keep doing your shit because obviously you're doing something yeah, right. She handles the hate well. You she know, does. Everybody got a keep opinion. Keep making your money. You must, people must remember though, when you post your music, when you do, when, when you put stuff online, you're being open to critical Judgment. analysis. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, people want to, people going to say, you put, put a picture of God online. <laughs> yeah, somebody gonna picture of Jesus Christ online. Everybody got an opinion. That's the Everybody, thing. Somebody gonna say something. So you it's just, just how you gonna uh, take that opinion. How you gonna roll with yeah. the punches? Or are you just gonna get knocked out and say I quit? Mm-hmm. I'm done. They hate me. Mm-hmm. Don't do that, sweetheart. Don't do that, sweetheart. You heard? What is what? what what's up here? What is this? You heard. get this off my reason. shit. Who is, uh, Ray? Get off my. <laughs> 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 I ain't gonna say that. That's why I'm not putting my phone in the mirror because y'all are nosy. <laughs> y'all are nosy. Get off my Reese's. <laughs> Damn. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <I see. laughs> hey. Get off my recents. Okay. Do you don't, you don't clear your recents? I I just found that you could do that. 
just yeah. now while looking at it. Yeah. <laughs> In this very moment, I found out you yeah. can clear your reasons. I remember I was trying to pick up from the girl. I'm going to clear my like, reasons. Oh, I see all the girls you just picked up right now. <laughs> Damn. Oh, you at the club? Uh huh. <laughs> what the bar? Are you talking about that? I see all the girls you just That's picked funny up. Right as hell. <laughs> That's funny when as hell. That's funny. When's the last time y'all went to the bar? Last week. Last week. <laughs> <laughs> last week. Last week. Yeah. What bar y'all to? Harbor. Shout out to Harbor. Harbor? Is that Shout right here? Shout out to Harbor. Yes, sir. That's the yes, one right man. here. You catch Edison and Dede any day of the weekend live on Pine. No, uh, I if don't you think that. If you from Long come right to Pine. I don't <laughs> think you can do that, but maybe one of these weekends. Who knows? Maybe the weekday. What, what is Dede? Oh, my God. Why am I mirroring this shit? Dede, Dede, let me it, stop mirroring this shit. Keep that shit on one thing. Let's just keep it on the double XL thing for right We're now. done with him. We are done with double XL. <laughs> we are done with double XL. We're done with so for now, For an overview of double XL, mute that shit. I fuck with him, uh-huh. though, but muted. But over overall analysis, Double XL, you need, we need to find more artists that are lyrically doing it out here. Yeah, right? for sure. Yeah, I, so, I, I think so. I definitely think so. So, on other news in hip hop and music, what else? Oh, it's it's going up right now. They throwing shots and people cribs and shit and try to do home invasions. Yeah, and shit. they. Uh, <laughs> my man Dirk, Dirky yo, my man Dirky. Give me this girl. <laughs> So apparently your goal is because of that though okay so yeah so the, like the story is that they were in their house chilling mm-hmm. you know some people came in from the well he lives in a gated uh, community right where chicago i don't know they're not giving no that, atlanta we, atlanta not, that's what it is he's saying stop atlanta. saying his information he's a he's motherfucker a, is on the internet what you talking about he's a one it's man. all on the I, internet uh, 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 obviously uh, they know where he lives they just came <laughs> to his house yeah so yeah i guess he lives somewhere in atlanta i don't know that for sure don't quote us on it but quote me on it he lives in the gated community <laughs> <laughs> he lives in a gated community. Yeah, Dirk called yeah. him on it. <laughs> he lives in a gated community, and I guess they people snuck in from the woods or something. Oh shit! And then uh, he, they, it says him and his girl exchanged fire. That, that's oh, what I read. Him too. And India exchanged fire. <laughs> <throwing> <laughs> blows. <laughs> this is like Get him back. it's like Crater the Grave with DMX and Aaliyah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's what's up. laughs> he hey, baby, get no, the gun. Hey. The fact that she he, she unloading. Hey, that's why everybody saying they goals. He probably he probably he probably. I don't they, want them type of goals. I don't want that problem. You don't want a woman that's going to defend I mean, you I do want a woman that's going to... I do want a woman that can wanna, stand up for me, but I wouldn't say that's my goal to have that. Like, well, I, th- I think when people say that that's their goal, like, goals, like, they don't necessarily want to be in a predicament, they, but the women are saying, like, I'll defend you to this moment. Okay. Like, that'll be me. That's okay, me. I can see that. Like, you remember when Nipsey had the breaking down? He was telling Lauren London how to break down things. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know, like, yeah, yeah, like she gonna, yeah, yeah. That was every girl saying, I want a drug dealer. I want to do this. Right, right. Teach me how to break, you know, right. break shit down. You know what I'm saying? I see what you're saying. So when they post okay. pictures like that, they're just speaking. Of, you ever notice that a girl posts the girl she looks like as the model she always likes? Like, uh-huh. they, it's just, it's, it's just okay. uh, you know, Instagram analysis. I see. I but see. We'll, well, that's another subject. I see. Oh, but anyway. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> <laughs> that, ain't a, that ain't a joke. That's a true shit. That's true. That's true. That's a true shit. But back to the. Uh, yeah, so you said they came from the woods. Mm hmm. And then what? I guess they tried to get into his crib. You feel me? I don't know the, the ins and outs of it, but they got in there. You feel me? In a dirty your hands, the, the, the burner to India. <laughs> India flips over the mattress and onto the floor, <laughs> hit, the, hit the ground, and get on one knee and start busting. Ooh. Uh, that's what I, I, you know. And they, they, that's what you're supposed to do, though. I, don't know. I mean, I think it's somebody close to him. Yeah, it ain't no way, ain't no way nobody knows where you live like that. It got to be. Like, it's like, come on. To now. know where to come through the and woods, to come to your house and. Tangling too much shit. It's way too like, much going on. It's that's that's a scary uh position to be in as a celebrity. Just knowing you mm-hmm. can't trust your circle. Yeah. Or I'm not even saying somebody in the circle, but possibly. Yeah. Not knowing who the fuck you could trust well, and can't trust because you in the home, the, the comfort of your home, and people coming in trying to rob you. Damn. Mm-hmm. Savage out here. This is the question though. Would me and Edison rob you? You said what? Would me and Edison rob you? No. You know it's well enough, right? Yeah. You just just off top. but it's a different type of atmosphere when you got that much fame and that much people around that many people around you many people you gotta shake hands with and be cool with and in the studio with out the studio with making money with you don't know who you fucking trust don't bring nobody to your home this is true but i mean it's outside the people that you that you know how you just answer you that think question? you could trust because a lot of people are slick out here you think you could trust a certain person in that's true you feel me i don't know but, but they like, handled they handled the situation well, as far as I know. This is like a uh, it's a learn lesson for him, I guess, for whatever happened because he knows some deeper shit than what they even yeah, reported. What's up? What's up? It could be some whole other shit. Could be. They might not even came to rob the motherfucker. So. Right. This is probably what they told the police or something. So, but we ain't gonna get into that. <laughs> we ain't gonna get into all of that. We ain't gonna get into that. We gonna keep it. Where's that? But India, you did your shit. <laughs> you did your shit. 
So wait, 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 wait. Back to you, nigga. What? You said that you wouldn't necessarily like that. I said I wouldn't make that. That's not my goal to get robbed and have my girl have to shoot back. I'm, that's not my goal to be in that position. But if you do get robbed, I you would want my girl. woman to, to fight back. Yes. I'd be impressed. You'd I be would impressed. too. She I'd be is. like, damn. She got active. She got active. Hell yeah. I would be like, hot. I, I have <laughs> no choice to get with her. Like, all right, I got you. Oh, no, no, you <laughs> have oh, yeah. If she go before you, nigga, you, yeah, gotta, yeah, you, you gotta go full out. You gotta go all out. You gotta go seven, nigga. Snap it next with your bare hands, nigga. Twisting them with your fingers, nigga. Like, damn, hold on. But that, 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 off like that. No hesitation. Oh, shit. When your girl gotta get active, that don't like a whole other shit of the nigga. Oh, everything. Like, animal instinct going up. Oh, everything. Oh. They going up. Has I that, gotta go up. Uh. Has that ever happened to you in life where uh, some shit happened and you had to get active? Yeah, man. I used to date uh, hot headed women. They would pop off of the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> or you know, I had, she popped off, so I gotta pop off a little bit more. Like, yeah, we both popped. I know that happened to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, not it has. That hasn't happened to me. I remember specifically a story. Oh, it has happened to me. Yeah. It has happened to me. <laughs> this was a while ago, though. This was a while ago. Yeah, I forget I about that, that with shit. the girls, right? Yeah. Yeah, it, it has happened to me. <laughs> and having somebody... I, I tell the story? No, yeah. I'm not gonna tell the story. Not gonna tell the story, story, but I'm gonna just say this. Like, oh, I was saying this. Like, if you, if hey, that's what girls, women, women, y'all gotta know when to pop remember. off. If it's just, if it's just you and your dude, you can't just pop off crazy at the mouth when there's a group of other niggas. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you gotta know when to pop off. Sometimes oh, you gotta Edison, be, you were there. I was. When you said that, did it? I yeah. thought about three different times. <laughs> but when he said something, I remember. You remember what I'm talking about? Halloween. Yeah. It was Halloween. Yeah. Halloween. I'm not going to go to the story, but Halloween. <laughs> it was Halloween. Remember Halloween? This was like 2018, probably. <laughs> 2017. I don't remember. This is a long time ago. Okay. Well, well I'm not going to go to the story, but. Yeah, there's no, you know, we know what it is. But I will go to, no, I'm not going to go to the story at all. <laughs> <laughs> but Edison, have you uh, have had to uh, defend any, any woman's honor? Any woman's honor? Yeah. In, in public? Yeah. Yeah, I feel like he does that in the bar after his 10th shot. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga goes in there. Hey, don't be looking at her like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is an even better question. Well, we, we, we're we wrapping up. We wrapped up hip-hop. Nothing is interesting right now. We've already talked about... Oh, wait a minute. Snow Allegra. She has a dope-ass song on her shit. I said I was going to listen to that. It's called Taste. It sounds hard as fuck. Taste? Taste. I think I heard. That shit is hard. I don't want to let you be mine. Taste. <laughs> <laughs> that shit is hard. Hey, did you and your girl end up watch, uh, listening to the album? I'm telling you. That we talked about last time. Not that. her. Not Snow Lake. That was who it was. Oh, that's who it was? That's oh, who it was. Oh, Lager. okay. So okay. Oh, yeah, Lager, yeah, yeah. Uh, your album was great. Okay, dope. It was dope. You had Tyler Ty, Ty, Pierre feature on there. Shit like that. How was that? It was dope. Everything was dope. Everything was dope. Okay, but back to the conversation we was having. We're wrapping up hip hop right now. Yeah. So back to the conversation we was having. Before she even gets in that predicament, the loud mouth, can you spot her? Can I spot that she about to start tripping? No, before you even get into that scenario, uh-huh. can you spot it out? Like, this girl is about to give me some shit. Yes. I can. How? Energy is everything. Energy? <laughs> There's one. I'm not going to Energy you. is everything. I can feel you when you about to. you getting out your shell a little bit. I, no, 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 no. That's not that what, what I'm saying. About? That's not what I'm saying. Now, when you like, is there any personality traits that she may show? Oh, okay. Way like weeks before that, that show was like, oh, this girl is a live wire. Oh, yeah. You know, oh, like, yeah. You, maybe you I could, might not need to take her to the club today. Yeah. She might need to see four walls in home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Of what you course. Mean. <laughs> I know. Of course. What, you mean. what do you spot out? I, I don't think I've dated a woman that crazy. I spot <laughs> out <laughs> shit by the different <laughs> responses. Look, that is, I don't think I. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> no, no, but it's about it's, no, you can, I know we know somebody. You we can spot somebody. it we, out hey, by. Hey, hey. We know somebody that has. Yeah, we, we are. Yeah, we, we do. All we all do. We has. all know somebody that has. <laughs> I don't know why y'all looking at me. Uh, we're looking at the camera. Oh, you know, I'm. You know, it's new audio makes us forget about the camera. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's, it's it's little subtle shit that you can see. In, in conversations, yeah. the, the different responses and the different mm-hmm. body language and the tone. <laughs> like, hold on, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Why'd you yeah. respond like that? <laughs> There's one person, I know we're getting kind of personal here with, with people and shit. I'm not we don't go natal names. Not gonna we say the person, we're not saying no names. But I'm just going to say where we was at. Go Martin ahead. Luther King. No, 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 no. Martin Luther uh, King. Uh, 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 where is, where is uh, Don Kennedy from? Lamert Park. Lamert. Oh. Lamert. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> if, she, hey, if she knows what that is, we'll bleed. We gotta bleep it out. If she listens, we can bleep it out. No, I mean, I've been, I we you know how many times I've been in Lamert Park? Yeah, we performed there. We, yeah. it, was actually, it was actually that time we performed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's a live one. <laughs> how did you know she was? I knew she was when we got to Lamert and she, um, she was telling people she don't like white people. Oh, Straight yeah. Straight to their face. You walk into okay. the house. Oh, now she probably know the fuck he's talking about. I don't, like, I don't <laughs> like white people. Now you probably, now she probably know who he's talking about. Okay, we're going to read. I won't like that. <laughs> no, she, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, live wire. Live wire. It, that's why, that's why I meant by the different ways. No. Do I know her? No, well, yeah, you know her. You know her. You've seen her. You've seen her before, but we're you not going to break that down. She, she didn't say specifically she didn't like white people, though. What'd she say? She was saying about Sorry for gentrification. You. That's what she was touching on. Yeah. And she was saying gentrification is a passive aggressive racism. That's what she said. She, she was, was telling walking me. up to people telling That's that. what she was walking yeah, up yeah, telling yeah. them. She's, she's lying. Yeah. She's, she's lying. Live wire. She's Do lying. I remember this? Was I there? You wasn't there, though. No? You wasn't there. Okay. And there's nothing wrong with being a live wire. That's your personality. You fire I love live wires. I'm a live wire. But sometimes you got to know when to That's crazy. There's bring levels. that shit back. There is levels. I'm a live wire. There is levels to this live wire shit. You have to be too live. You shock yourself. <laughs> you shock yourself and you can get shot yourself. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you can't just be too live out here. Exactly. But, uh, what, what, what? I want to know. Y'all live wire stories. I, I feel like every episode of my shit is Because <laughs> <laughs> you the nigga that's They talking. just on me. <laughs> Damn. What's, what's up? My, uh, my past experiences. I don't have any past experiences. Like I have, you don't have any past I'm experiences. <laughs> you, just because you married. It, ladies, yeah, ladies listen that, to me, ladies. Happens. Y'all cannot be mad at your significant other for having a past experience. And I'm not talking I'm specifically not, no, about no, you. No, I'm no. not talking <laughs> specifically about you. Yeah, I know. I'm I know. just talking about in no, general. No, no, you can. You can, but you... Because everybody had a past. You definitely have to have a... You, everybody you, has had a past. Your past, whoever you are, is what led you to your current situation that is right definitely now. true. Hey, so baby. you got to respect hey, the past. You feel me? Expect but it. Yeah, that's definitely true. Look, you and if you're, gonna, if you're going to ask some questions about the past... Don't take it too serious. Yeah, just be ready oh, yeah, to yeah, yeah, yeah. I, hear yeah. the truth if you want the truth. And if you don't yeah. want to hear it, don't ask it. Well, you shouldn't be asking any questions about any romantic thing in the past because anything was. Yeah, that's that Do person. you think y'all? Could, do you think you could be truth too truthful to a person you're dating um, about your past? Do you think it's some uh, shit yeah. you just need to let out? Just yeah, like not talk you know, about. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I haven't got on that subject, uh-huh. but I, I'm a talker, so you, you know, are. You know. <laughs> If yeah. I'm not hiding it from you and I'm telling you yeah. about it, I probably won't not go into detail. But right. <laughs> this is this is early. This is young Breeson. Right. But uh growing older you you realize that you don't need to go into that. You don't need to go into detail or everything. Like, yeah. is my makeup okay? Oh, oh, that conversation. Yeah. You need to be truthful with that. No, I am. No. I am definitely true, but I don't, okay. I don't care for makeup. There's a way to I don't care for makeup. Because I remember I dated a chick who she asked me about her, is her makeup right? And it wasn't okay. It was like, okay, this is this I, is early stages of makeup work. <laughs> probably like college or some shit. Mm. But her makeup was on, I but it's like, I could see like, it didn't match her chin and her neck. It was yeah. like a different color. I'm just like, mm. yeah, it looks good. Oh, you said that? Well, yeah. Well, let I me tell you my story about <laughs> the detail. <laughs> oh. There was a party at Cal State LA. Uh-huh. You know, remember those up the hill parties? Um, yeah. It's before you moved up the hill. It was- Okay, uh, it was, was, this is pre-move. This is pre-move. So okay. it was jumping up the, in the, in the, yeah, up the yeah. hill. So we get to the party, and the woman asks me, how's my makeup? She turns the light on in the car I'm in, and then uh, it's, like, it's like a little light on her face. It's like, it's like, little, it's like white a little bit. Uh-huh. I, I don't like it. I didn't like it. Like uh-huh. that. I didn't care for it like that. So I told her. You told her you didn't care for it? I was, well, I, I, I said, it's a little off. Uh, like, it's a little, it's a little light. <laughs> it's she over. threw a fit. She threw a fit. She threw a fit. Really? What did she say? Um, <laughs> yeah, she threw a fit. She was just like, um, "What do you mean? Just, just super, just hot, in, insecure about what I was saying." Damn. You know? So I immediately do that. I'm like, I'm over here like, oh, no, no, no. It looks, it looks. Uh, but I had so much <laughs> conviction in my voice when I said it the first time. <laughs> Damn. No do you more think party. we should just say yes? No more party. <laughs> it looks good. Uh, well, it does look good on some people. If it don't like, look good, like say my, it don't look good. My, I know that's what I feel like. If it don't like look my good. girlfriend, for example, she looks beautiful with makeup, but she looks <laughs> beautiful without it. So right, like, right. I don't like. It's not like she She needs it, right? Yeah, she like her smooth is fucking smooth as shit. Like yeah. it's not a pore on her fucking face. Right. So <laughs> I don't think she needs it, but she'll probably think otherwise. You no, know, but girls, you know, girls you know, think differently. Like, they think different. They right. want to get themselves nice right. and get the. I don't nails. mind makeup, but I do prefer uh, natural skin. Just yeah, you know. me too. Of course, I prefer the natural look. 
Magic I think every I think every man. No, nah, some men prefer. But no, like, when have you walked into the club or the bar and a nigga just be like, "Hey, your makeup is hidden right now." But to be honest, like, <laughs> your makeup is like, right like now. if we're getting you don't know like, what I'm these dudes say. <laughs> like, if we're going out, like you know, we're getting dressed and stuff like that. I don't mind you putting makeup on mm-hmm. and get fly and get that shit going. But right. I mean, if obviously if you can rock it without it, it's a plus. Mm-hmm. It's definitely a plus. Whoever can rock it without it, kudos to you. Yeah, and I just say I just want to say one more thing before we I don't know if we wrapping it up or not, but what's up with these uh BBLs, man? <laughs> just because we had a conversation before the camera cut on, I know we ain't talking about hip hop right now, but this sidebar, this is hip hop. Yeah, shit, this is, this is part, it's of, the a part of the culture. For sure. So <laughs> it's definitely a part, this of the is part of the culture. I see a lot of BBLs, and I'm just trying to see what's the what's y'all take on this. I have no take. I don't. I don't too much. Care you have about a take. It. You're a man. I think uh people could just. Stop following other people just because you see the girl that's getting all the accolades and maybe the money that uh-huh. has the BBL. You don't need to go get the BBL, right? You might have an ass that maybe other people might like. Everybody don't like a fat, fat ass. Yeah, some people like a flat, flat ass. A small <laughs> bubble. <laughs> small bubble. Yeah. yeah. Go work out with a small bubble. Go work out song. Yeah. yeah. Nothing yeah. wrong with a small bubble. But, but I feel like you, I think you should, if you are going to decide to do at least wait a couple months. Yeah. Do you your know. research. Do your research. Wait a couple months. You might change your mind. You feel me? You might get influenced and like, hold on. I really don't need. They're this. not gonna change their mind. Right? I know that, but I'm just saying. I think it's an epidemic. Twenty years, damn near every girl is gonna, gonna walk around with a BBL. I can see that. I don't think everyone. But do you, sweetheart? Do you? We ain't here to control you. I don't have a problem you. with it. Do you? I don't have a problem with anything anybody chooses to do with their body. Yeah. But I do think if you are gonna get it, try to get a natural look. As natural as possible, unless yeah. you just like yes. that. Uh, non-natural look then go for that yeah if you if do that's what you're going for you want to do hey i don't even know why we're talking about Facts. this topic because we're three fucking guys because yeah. it's yeah i mean it's part of the culture we got an opinion gonna, god damn it they're gonna that's be why. like oh these guys, these guys talk about our bodies look at what niggas do when they get together yeah, right about, <laughs> so let's talk about some guy stuff what's some guy shit it's a lot of guy shit what's some guy shit some guy. Don't chase a girl around in a club or the bar. We didn't see that. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a guy, remember uh, last time I was at the bar, dude was chasing old girl. Was that you? I was with? No, that wasn't. Was it Richie? What, what, tell tell Richie. us. Tell I us. think it was Richie. Like literally chasing. She was running. Oh, I do she, remember. Remember that? that she was running and dude was I chasing. Do like really, was, uh, she yeah. like stop. Like what do you? I mean, persistence though. It looked like you got her number later that night. Okay, so um, <laughs> that night though. What's the, what? What advice would you give a guy at the club to to? To get the girl without chasing. Not even the club, just any setting. Or any outside setting, just any not just setting. the club or bar. Just and you're in a social setting. What is, what is the advice you give the guy to uh, completely make his attention noticed by the girl? That's a good question. I mean, everything is do? based does off he? of energy. Like I said before, like you well, gotta feel it, the vibes. If the vibes is speaking to you and you feeling she wanna, she giving you that look and she giving you that that action to go, then you go. But it's a it's a thin line between pressing and smothering. Like what you want to press a little bit to show that you're interested, but you don't want to smother. It was like, oh, you're overwhelming with this shit. Hold up, yeah. thirsty ass yeah. boy. Yeah. <laughs> My first advice would be um, fix yourself first. Get your shit together. But you shouldn't be out in the club if you're not if you don't got nothing going on. Okay. Well, we're gonna say they have the shit together. And right. What do you tell them? What do you mean they got the shit together? After they get to like you know they're good. What? They could have their shit together financially and you know be good with their shit but maybe they not don't know how to talk to a girl what uh, what how can they not look stupid not but, look stupid yeah, right. like first off you gotta get thing. the eye contact first that's one that, eye contact that should be number one yes if you don't get that like first if you, one glance then two that's a that's a signal mm-hmm. to go then that, you go that's a signal to go that should be do if y'all <coughs> okay speaking of eye contact so if you talk to a girl y'all she make an eye contact with you do you break eye contact first uh, I mean, if I got a blink, yeah. I'm not talking about blink. Of course, we got a blink. I'm not talking about. <laughs> we're not doing a staring contest. I'm just talking about like as far as looking down or looking back because I feel like it's it's like some sort of like animalistic uh type of play when you having a, well, not a staring contest but just making eye contact. If you if you break first, it's like oh, got him, got him, alpha around this motherfucker. Well, if you saying if <laughs> maybe I think differently. Like, well, are you talking about with another girl? Yes, with a girl? not with a guy. <laughs> So what if you break? What if what if y'all looking at each other? Uh huh. You break, and you walk to a place which is right in front of her and say, "What's up?" 
Oh no, he's he? talking you know about, no, talking about during a conversation. You already step oh, up. Okay. And y'all okay, having yeah, a conversation. That, that, eye contact. When you're having a conversation, and that she, means everything. Yeah. That eye contact while you guys are everything. talking and she looks down, that means she, she may be bashful. She may be all type of things. It means a lot. I okay. just think as the man, okay. as that role, that alpha man, you don't break eye contact first. You, you, you should not. You should let her not. feel feel your presence yeah. through your eyes. Definitely. Like that's, feel me. Yeah, that's how you look. If I'm in the bar and I'm drunk. And you look at me in the eye. I don't know. I mean, pay attention to what you're saying. I'm probably just looking at you. <laughs> yeah, that, I was gonna I'm say that too. I'm the type of person to just look at you, and then you'd be like, "Oh yeah, fuck anything you're saying right now." <laughs> yeah, because I was gonna say that um, the man has to be involved in like yeah. that he wants to come across an eye because we, you know, like it's you're, the focus has to be there. It, it the has focus to be there. Is, it has to be oh, there. which this is gonna be off topic. We could to finish that, but the focus definitely has to be there. But I'm gonna get on a no, more motivational, motivational mm-hmm. thing. And I want to ask you guys, let me ask Edison first. How do you, what how would you tell somebody to keep focused? To focus? Keep focus, yeah. Of what? Like, what In, do you mean? Uh, career path, just whatever they want to do, how do you keep focused on it when you feel a little unmotivated? Or what would what what you tell people to keep focused? Uh, just remember the why. Why, why you're doing, doing it. it. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just remember that. That's it. Because mm-hmm. sometimes distractions can get in the way. And it's like, hold on. Even working out, I'd be asking myself, like, when I'm working out and pain tired, you'd be like, what the fuck am I doing this? <laughs> you know, but then again, you then you remember that why. It's like you might, why might be like losing weight mm-hmm. or getting in shape, you know, whatever it is. Just remember the why. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I agree. Johnson? That's what helped me uh, finish my goals or complete some of my goals is remember why I'm doing it. Uh-huh. Just always having that in the back. Give me my another mind. reason, though. Don't just hit pop. That's up hard Virgo. because that's. Let me see. Um, You've done motivate it. those around me, so they can keep you motivated. Yes, that's sure. a good. That's that's, a that's good my one. that's mm-hmm. my number one thing. Yeah, because yeah. I could say something like you know like um, shit. I want to do a podcast. I will tell this nigga Edison and you. All right. If y'all know what I want to do, so they gonna <laughs> hold me to the fire and be like, "Nigga, what, you what's said up? You was gonna do that. Uh, you ain't doing it, nigga. What's up? This nigga Edison gonna make me look feel bad as hell. Yeah. Like, what man? What's going on? So <laughs> like, oh, damn, that's definitely a, a number one thing in my. It, in my it's show. crazy how like people have different ways to do it though. Uh-huh. Like he likes to express himself. I don't mm-hmm. like to express myself for what I'm doing until I get to that goal. Yeah, yeah. And I feel like I'm a little bit of both. Yeah. Yeah, Daddy's definitely. I see more Daddy <laughs> like me though. I'm a like, little bit of both. Like, like, like I stay though. quiet about certain shit, but, but then I also gotta express a little certain shit because yeah. it kind of it helps that. me. Yeah, I think either way is good. Yeah. It's just well for the expressing part, it depends how you how you express it. Right. How and who you express and it who to. You're, that's definitely because uh, yeah, that's definitely. Just know if you express anything to me, I will count it count you accountable for. <laughs> I think we all, yeah, yeah. all would hold somebody. That, well, our close friends that are expressing yeah. something to us accountable. We'll keep y'all motivated, though. The listeners. You see, I have to get yeah, deeper. Yeah, yeah, y'all let the us listeners. know. keep y'all motivated. Y'all ain't even been commenting. Niggas been clicking on this shit, not commenting. 94-7, the way he... I just want to do that. <laughs> hey, how you doing out there? In radio, man? I, I just feel like I got that voice. I hope y'all sexy. like the sound. <laughs> I hope you guys like the sound, too. We, they will. We've, uh, they better. Added on to everything. Y'all, yeah. y'all can see why we're doing what we're doing and why we've right. been waiting and not filming and stopping to film but one yeah. episode we're gonna one episode in about six months we're gonna give you guys like behind the scenes talk like what yeah, what talk. what motivated us to even do what we do but so tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a f- another friend to tell subscribe another motherfucking friend and tell that motherfucking neighbor that's nosy and down the street talking about it's too loud Oh yeah, the bass too too rough. <laughs> <laughs> I got to work in the morning. It's yeah. three o'clock in the <laughs> three p.m. Afternoon. It is three p.m. <laughs> <laughs> but I got work in the morning. I'm sorry. It's just <laughs> oh man. But yeah, but tell that friend too to subscribe. Shit. Subscribe. Ring Need the motherfucking bell. Let's do it. We about to be out, man. Stay motivated, guys. Yeah, stay motivated. Episode. Stay 34. motivated, fellas. Keep that eye contact. Don't break it. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>